Hello everybody, welcome back to Fish That Won't Quit. Today I'm going to show you how to tie the Albright Knot. The Albright Knot is a great knot used to tie two lines together. For example, a braided fishing line to a monofilament, or a braided line to fluorocarbon, or even monofilament to fluorocarbon. Now with your line, you're going to have your main line, in this case my orange line, and my leader line, my yellow line. So with your main line you're going to start with, you're going to want to double that over, about six inches here and create a loop on the other end. Now with that loop, you're gonna grab your leader line and place it up and through. I like to give myself about eight to 10 inches of leader tag to work with. Now this step, I like to actually put my finger through at this point and keep this loop nice and tight against the leader and pinch and keep that loop there around your finger this entire time. Now what that does is make your leader tag come to the left along with your two mains. And this step is also tricky. You're going to flip this tag end back toward your loop and then this tag end is going to wrap around itself and the two main lines doubled over. Now with the thicker line I like to do three to six wraps. With the lighter line six to ten wraps. So we're going to do that right now. So with one, two, three, four, five, okay. Now with your right hand, you can actually let go of that line with your finger and you'll actually see how that tag end's coming through this loop. Your new tag end is gonna go through that loop in the same exact direction, just like so. Now with your right hand, you can go ahead and hold on your leader line. And with your left hand, you can go ahead and grab just the main line. And now at this point, I like to lubricate this knot. Okay, and you can start slowly pulling this knot toward itself. And just work those loops down the main line. Great. Now you'll have two tag ends to cut off there. We'll go ahead and do that right now. You can make these cuts pretty close to your knot. That's great. With that, you'll have a completed Albright knot. Thanks for watching. Hope this video helped out and stay tuned for more videos.